Hi, it's Todd from Soundpure Studios and Pro Audio Sales. Today we're going to take a look at Millennia's incredible STT1 channel strip, one of the most comprehensive studio workhorse tools in existence. We rely on our pair of STT1s on all of the serious commercial recording projects that we do here at Soundpure, on everything from distorted electric guitars to drums, vocals, and for the two bus mixing and mastering applications that we do here. The Millennia STT1 is an integrated channel strip featuring Millennia's outstanding clean and transparent preamp, equalizer, compressor, and de-esser. It also includes Millennia's unique twin topology design, which combines a 50-volt solid-state amplifier and a 400-volt vacuum tube path all in the same unit. You can select between vacuum tube or solid-state paths at the input, and then also choose tubes or solid-state at the input of the EQ and compressor section. If you watch our other Millennia videos, you can hear the difference between the two paths in different configurations. Check them out at www.soundpure.com. The tube signal path adds a harmonic warmth, color, and three-dimensionality that only real authentic high-end tube gear could provide, whereas the solid-state path is as true to the original source material as you can imagine, clean and transparent. Let's take a closer look at its other features. The unit gives the option of mic, line, or instrument selection and separate gain control for either the vacuum tube or solid state input, whichever you have selected by that switch. There are also phantom power and polarity reverse switches. Finally, there's a transformer on off switch which allows for even more tonal and coloration variability. Be sure and check out our other videos where we engage different combinations of the tubes and transformer to achieve harmonically complex and musical results in subtle ways. The EQ features a four band parametric. The outer bands of the EQ, the low and high frequency bands, have fixed selectable frequencies that can be switched between peak and shelf. The two mid-bands have continuously variable frequencies with plus or minus 15 dB. The mid-frequencies also have a narrow Q at 4.0 to a wide Q at 0.4. This allows for extreme precision for removing offending frequencies in a precise and surgical manner, or setting the EQ up for broad stroke tonal coloration shifts. The times 10 section allows for extremely high frequencies up to 25K for putting a little air into your tracks. The EQ has the color option of either Class A vacuum tube or Class A solid state signal path by the switch that is shared by the compressor as we had mentioned before. We have an entire video focusing on this amazing EQ. To get a sense of how powerful this EQ is, go to www.soundpure.com. We do also have a comprehensive video covering the compressor that you should definitely check out. The compressor has a highly sensitive threshold knob continuously adjustable from minus 20 to plus 20 dB an attack knob that is continuously adjustable from 2 milliseconds to 100 milliseconds, and a release knob from 20 milliseconds to 3 seconds, which is also continuously adjustable, and finally a ratio knob that allows from 1.4 to 1 to 30 to 1 limiting. Two STT1s can be linked for compression of stereo material by a simple RCA connection on the back panel. Be sure and check out our Mastering the Stereo Bus video where we use our pair of STT1s in exactly this way. Go ahead and impress me. Taking a look at the back panel, it's clear that this unit is as flexible with its connectivity as it is with its front panel controls, making it truly one of the most powerful pieces of analog signal processing on the market today, period. There are two XLR main outputs and one quarter inch unbalanced connection. The unit contains a direct out line ends in both quarter inch and XLR for feeding line level material to the unit, and a mic input, all in the back panel. Finally, the unit includes a de-esser. If the de-esser is in use, the compressor is disabled because the de-esser works using the compressor's controls. The de-esser in the STT1 is meant for moderate de-essing tasks, but can be a very useful tool. Thanks for checking out this overview of the STT1. For the STT1 in action, watch our mastering video with the STT1s as a stereo pair and our other videos demonstrating the compressor and EQ in depth. We cover this unit in amazing detail over the course of our Millennio video series, online at www.soundpure.com. If you have any other questions about Millennia's products, call us over here at SoundPure. We're using these incredible pieces of recording equipment in our studios daily, which is connected directly to our sales building. Real professional recording advice is always just a phone call away at SoundPure. Give us a ring. Well, you take me out with your ocean.